You have five seconds to get out or you're sitting. One, two, three, four. What's up fam? Good morning, but you weren't expecting to see that face. So I did this little poll on my Instagram. If you don't follow me on Instagram, make sure you go follow me on there. <laughs> Sorry, this is hard for me to look at. If you guys follow me on Instagram, or if you don't follow me on Instagram, I asked a bunch of questions specifically about my videos, you know, details about that kind of stuff. I was like genuinely interested in what you guys had to say. And one of the things that so many people said was that they wish they saw more of me. Like, and that was, I don't know, it's weird to me. Naturally as a mom, you, I think, you make everything about your kids, you know? So I think that's like very normal. I just kind of felt like my life is not boring because I don't think it's boring at all. But I think when you live it every day, you think like, what is there to really talk about with myself, you know? So I figured I would open up the vlog this morning completely just raw, vulnerable, empty, just like Jess. No makeup. I mean, I have a little bit of concealer on actually already because I'm in the middle of getting ready. I don't think this is necessarily what people were talking about when they said they wanted to see more of me, but another thing that some people said that they wanted to see was more of my like daily routine. And I think I did so much of that for so long that I kind of like stopped doing it, you know? I was like, this is getting so repetitive, like we do this every day, but I guess it's been a while since I've been doing that. So I promise to bring you guys on more of our day-to-day -day journeys, starting with getting ready. I'm actually waiting to do my eyebrows. Every like month or so, I actually dye my eyebrows. I've definitely never shown this on a video, but I've talked about it before because this, these are my natural eyelashes and eyebrows. They're so, so blonde. I literally draw them on every single day because I feel like I look like an alien if I don't. Are you gonna shower here? Yeah. I'm filming. Whoa. Well, let's film something. You guys, I try to get Chris in the videos. She doesn't get out. Shut up! I literally always ask to She's like, get out. You always say inappropriate stuff. Shut up! No, I don't. I just edit inappropriate stuff out. <laughs> He's standing in his boxers right next to me right now. Who says boxers? Are they not boxers? What are they? Okay, take a shower. I'm still gonna film though. Okay, so I'm dyeing my eyebrows this morning. For me, what I do, I always wonder what people are thinking when I buy this dye. I buy this dye and my hair looks like this, and they're like, what the heck are you thinking? Anyway, for my eyebrows, I get the dark blonde color, and I just get like the cheapest box. This is usually the cheapest like box to dye. Trust me, I ain't no pro with this. And honestly, it doesn't really make a huge difference, but I feel like when I take my makeup off, you can at least see them like a tiny bit. So like when we go swimming and stuff like that, I like to have my eyebrows dyed. That way when all my makeup comes off, I don't look as alien-like. I know that's kind of a harsh word, but Addie probably took out your hot water when she took a shower. But like this vlog is already all over the place. This is why I, I don't do good with. Vlog. Shut up. I always have to have a plan when I vlog. That was attractive. I always have to have a plan when I vlog. Otherwise I feel all over the place. Oh, I cannot talk while I do this. Why does that look funny? I should burn my eyebrows off. So any fellow gingers out there who want to do this, cause not all of them do. Like some people like rock this like they don't need any makeup or whatever. And people have said that about me too, but I think it's more of just like a personal preference. And for me, I just, I like to have eyebrows. <laughs> Ginger's unite. Ginger 101 though, this stuff saved my life. Anastasia Brow Wiz and Caramel. That's what I always have in my eyebrows. It took me years to find something that had a decent red tint to it. Okay, so I'm gonna use this as my mirror this morning. If you're wondering where the kids are, they are all happily downstairs on their iPads because it is Saturday. And as you guys know, they're not allowed to have any screen time during the week. So they like to take advantage of the iPad time when they can. Do I let them sit on it all day? Absolutely not. But in the mornings, it's nice to just have a little bit of peace and quiet while they're sitting there being mindless zombies. I feel like it's okay once in a while, right? Kind of justify it for me. Yeah, I am. I think it's okay to let them be mindless zombies, like in moderation. <laughs> Lilia actually got picked up and went with her grandma this weekend. She's such a busy child that it's hard to distribute her between family members who want her. But this weekend, we were like re really open. For some reason, we have nothing going on this weekend. It's about to be the last week of school for the big kids. It's Memorial Day weekend, and there's just literally nothing going on. So we're thinking about taking the kids out to the lake, but I need to prioritize myself a little bit beforehand I have a little bit of work to do I need to do my eyebrows and then we'll just 
play it by ear as the day goes on, huh? I'm pretty sure dyeing your eyebrows is like not recommended. Anything near your eyes, but hey, here I am. A few minutes later. Okay, I know this looks harsh. It never actually looks like this though. It always looks way darker than it is. I always leave it on for like the longer end of how long you're supposed to leave it on because the dark blonde is like almost just not dark enough sometimes but i don't want to go any darker because i'm like they're so light like look at that look at the difference of it and you can still like hardly see it i don't want to like pay someone to do it either because this box is like four bucks if that actually might be even be a little bit cheaper i'll draw these on in a little bit but i'm gonna go check on the kids oh and i changed my dress by the way maybe i should address that i don't even think i'm gonna wear this though because all my dresses are so short like too short like i want just like a nice summer dress but i feel like this is a little bit to like, woo, not family friendly on the side. We were going back and forth, but we decided we are gonna go out to a lake today. So I'm gonna give you guys the honors of packing your own snacks. That way there's no, you guys can pack your own snacks. Let's see how this goes. Come on. Whoa, boys, before we go anywhere, this needs to be cleaned up. This is embarrassing. And then we will pack your snacks. I'm gonna get Top Robin in a bag and I'm gonna probably get cereal because Top cereal and Top Robin are good and, and marshmallows. I'm gonna get these two. I'm gonna get cheese it. This is all for these, these things. I saw they grabbed bags of Top Ramen and Cheerios. So I'm thinking I'm gonna grab some extra like healthy snacks, like oranges, some fruit, stuff like that. Pack that because I'm pretty sure that they didn't. I changed my outfit again. I am just having one of those days. There's some days where I feel like I look so good and other days where I just feel like I look like a bag of trash. I grabbed some snacks, some sunscreen, their shoes. Do we need water shoes? Do they need water shoes, do you think? I don't think so. No, I mean they have like 10 toes if they step on something with one of them They still have nine one of these days I'll have to do like a what I pack when we go out, but I guess it like really depends on where we're going, huh? Are you ready? No, I have to make a thumbnail for my video and then I'll be ready He gets frustrated sometimes because I always say okay. I'm almost done. I'm almost done editing I'm almost done editing and then I'll be like okay I'm done editing but then I have to make a thumbnail and a title and make it live So technically I'm not really done done, but I'm almost done. They're literally just waiting on me We're meeting up with Ryan and Rosalind and their kids again. They're already there They've been there for like hours and we just decided kind of last minute that we were gonna join them It's already 1 in the afternoon, so we should probably get going because I think it's like an hour away <laughs>
beer bottle up with sand. Good job. Addie found a ladybug and it has no spots on it. Doesn't that mean something? It's like a I think boy. It's a different gender. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't I think, know. Is it a boy? You know? Wait. Ladybug with ladybug. no spots. It's an orange ladybug with no spots. Go follow me on Instagram and on my latest post, tell me if that means it's a boy or a girl. If you know. <laughs> Coming to the end of a one-way street. Wish I could wake up, but it's not a dream. Staring at the wall right in front of me. We do, buddy. Oh, 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 oh. To get away, I can stay right here Every day I'm wishing that you went near I cannot pretend that I do not care oh, oh. What the? Sit here talking about how hungry are, how hungry we are What is that? A turkey? Yeah. Is it? Yeah, it's a turkey What is it? It has, no it doesn't have a thing it's, Yeah, it's a little Where is it, where is it's little go gobble gobble? Yeah, it's an adolescent it's an adolescent turkey. Where's its parents? We've been here for quite some time now. It's been so relaxing because I feel like every time we take our kids somewhere that's like outward, especially specifically if they have water, if there's water for them to play in, the kids don't even like bug us at all. They just like go and they play. No screen time, no whining. They have no complaints. We have food, we have water, and they have somewhere to play. And it's so refreshing because we can just sit here and just watch them all day. And something about just like getting vitamin D in your system, I don't know. Going to like an inside museum is so different than going somewhere outdoors. Cause they just, they're so, like right now, I don't even know what they're doing over there. They're like building something. We're starting to get hungry because it's getting to be dinner time and the kids have snacks and stuff. They don't even bother us, not even for two seconds. I mean, not that they like bother us, but you know, like I'm hungry, I'm thirsty. They're just playing. I don't know, it's so refreshing to see when your kids are doing like normal kid stuff. And now the sun is starting to set here too. We were talking about how most of our boys all had umbilical hernias when they were born. Both of her twins had, and then both my twins and Landon also had umbilical hernias. So we're talking about their belly buttons and these fools come out and they start belly dancing. Look at this. Who does this? Look at that. Look at that. The talent. Like what? Can you do it too? What? <laughs> that is some talent. Look at him. <laughs> Kaden, can you do it? Oh. Oh. Full show. <laughs> can you do it? Ooh. <laughs> I could never. Half of my stomach now is numb too, so now there's just no way. The bottom half of my stomach is numb. This one's out. Kira, okay baby, was posting about how her daughter has it. Or she was she was like, is this normal? It looks so much less like prominent that though now that they're older. So they used to totally normal. Did they? No, waste water bottles, please. They were like, why is my like that nobody else uses? No way! They were fine with it. Well, now they have Kyson and Kaden, so. True. Well, I told them I said everybody's different. Yeah. God, it's just right there, Addie. Look. Oh God, we're such like city folk. Look, it's a deer. It's right there. Oh my God. Good job, dude. High five. He spotted that. No, 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 no. It's gonna scare it. You're gonna scare it. It's just like hanging out. I can't believe that, guys. Have you ever seen one before? No. Have you ever seen a deer before, buddy? No. Never. I don't think these kids have ever seen one. Definitely not this close. Addie's like kitty. Do you think it's a girl deer or a boy deer? I think it's a boy. It's a boy. Why do you think it's a boy? Because it doesn't have fur. It's a girl deer. You know why? If it doesn't have antlers, that means it's a girl deer. Springtime too, there's a chance it could be pregnant. There's a fly in my hair. In my hair? No, no, stop, stop. This is, is like it? a... Get it out, get it out. <laughs> what is it, what was it? Oh God, thank you. <gasps> Jonah just saved me. There was another bug in my hair, Rosalind. The bugs have been loving me today. I, I found like, yeah, I was sitting in the chair and he's like, look, 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 look. And me and Rosalind are like, what the hell are you talking about? Look. And he's like, there's a spider in your hair. I'm like, you <laughs> And then there was 
two other spiders after that that were that landed on me. To that. See you act fast. Oh god, it's running through me. I need to get out of this place. I'm not a camping person or a nature person at that really, unless it involves the beach. I'm wondering if she's like having pregnancy cravings and she like really needs that grass right now, so she doesn't really care what comes in her way. Like I'm gonna get that. Look at it's coming towards you. Oh. Charlie, she's pregnant, and I need you alive for us to go to. I feed. don't know if she is pregnant. She is pregnant. Are you feeding her? Are you delivering the baby, Obi? Oh, Look at that. that! Oh my God! I have never seen something like this before. It's not even running away. I don't want to scare her. Do you think she would eat anything? Like we have food. No. This is her home. They're like freaking out that it's walking away. They're hiding from it. Okay, you guys, that's enough exploring. She's minding her own business. Let's go. You want to see it go where? This is where it lives, bro. We were all so tired and so hungry that I totally forgot to pick up a camera, which does not happen that often, like at all. Legitimately, I was about to go to sleep right now and then I was like, holy crap, I didn't pick up the camera. Something about being outdoors, like, makes you so tired. It was meltdown central as soon as we walked in. Come here. If you're cold, come get come get out. Mom, can I see the camera back? No. It's time to go to sleep. Mommy's tired. You have five seconds to get out. Or you're sitting in there. One. Two. Three. Three. Four. Thank you. You know the funny thing about that is that I don't know what happens when I get to five. I've never had to get there. That's all for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night.